with the drag movement's popularity, are you competitive with other dragsters? Uh, dragsters? Uh, you know, um, I mean, in the industry, you know, it's like, you ever seen Showgirls? Yeah. Remember the Pearls? Yeah. It's, it's like that. But Who's... we're men and we fall, you know, we're so padded up. When we fall, it's like a crash dummy. Nobody really gets hurt. <laughs> are you number one now? I mean, I think RuPaul's number one forever. Um, and then I think even someday when he passes away, his ghost will be more famous than any of us. But um, I'm probably like number 12. What does RuPaul do that others don't do? Or what makes RuPaul... RuPaul writes the checks. He what? He writes the checks. Like RuPaul, sort of like on Drag Race, RuPaul like takes his mega stardom and gives you like a... He gives you like, he doesn't just give you the corn, he teaches you to grow the corn and it's up to you to grow the corn. You like him. Yeah, do you like corn? Yeah. Love corn. I do too. On the cob? Totally. Oh, yeah. Me too. And RuPaul, I mean, I think she's just, she's the original. I mean, you have to think like in the 90s for a tall African-American man to put on a blonde wig. It was pretty impactful. Never miss a beat. Subscribe to Larry King now and watch new episodes every day.